Kill him. All right, so we're out playing collars today. We had a bunch of them over there that we still need to plant. They're in these cell packs. And I've already planted two or three right here. But I wanted to show y'all, when these get a little leggy, and these are fine, look how pretty they are. But they're just a little leggy. So I'm gonna show you how to plant these so they'll grow. So I'm gonna push it out of the pack. And one reason I'm doing this is we've given away several of these packs. And look, look at all the collars there. So what you wanna do is, it's not, obviously, if the collars were not leggy, you would just plant them like this depth, like to here. So we're gonna break up that root ball. You can see how it's starting to grow around the little cell pack. And they need to be in the ground about that deep. So you can see how much is gonna be going into the ground. So here we go. And we have the whole dug here. And we got them a little close together. And then we're just going, we've already broken up the root ball. So you can see I just kind of held those where they needed to be. And that way I can adjust and, and kind of shake the dirt down in there. And look at that. Is that pretty or what? Mm -hmm. And that'll grow even though it's a little bit deep. A lot of times when you plant collards, if you plant them in the seeds and you just plant them, uh, you know, without coming out of these cell packs, what they'll do is they'll turn up and then they'll kind of make an L make a turn and then grow back up. So you want to cover that part of the stem. So I'll do one more for you here. Pop it out of the, pop it out of the cell pack. Well, I got two here, so that's all right. So we'll tear these apart without tearing them up, hopefully. I'll just lay that one aside. So I'm gonna grab it here about where it needs to be. Y'all see that? So I'm gonna know that I'm gonna plant it about that deep. I'm gonna break up the root ball I'm gonna put it down in here in the hole, kind of hold my hand where it needs to be. We're gonna put the soil back in here around it, kind of hold it. You say, well, you're covering up a little bit of the stem. Well, I may be covering up a lot, but, and you can always pull it up some, but that's about the way it needs to be. And you can see down these collars that we had planted from a week or two ago, you can see the ones that we planted too shallow. In other words, we just planted them like this. All right, so let's pretend we planted them just like this and we planted them down in the soil. And you can see, you can tell which ones were like that and which ones were planted correctly. So see like this one, you can see this one, it was probably planted too shallow, not deep enough. But you can see these were all planted probably deep enough. So you can kind of pick them out and tell which ones See kind of right in the middle right there? All those were probably planted too shallow right there. So the ones over on the right side were probably about right. That's how, about how deep they need to be planted. So some we got correct, some we didn't. So again, we'll do one more. Get it about where it needs to be. Break up your root ball. Just like that. Put it into the ground. Cover it up. Hold your leaves. And like I said, it won't hurt a thing. Throw some of those stems. That looks about right. That one's pretty good there. Did better on that one than I did the last one. So that's kind of how it needs to look. Keep them watered, keep them fertilized, and should be fine. All right. Thanks for watching. We'll have another video for you.